So at first we're gonna add to both sides of the equation 6. So we'll get the t over 8 equals to negative 12 plus 6. And that's gonna be negative 6. Then we're gonna multiply both sides of the equation by 8. So we'll get the t, t equals to negative 6 times 8. So t equals to negative 48. And now we put t equals to negative 48 in the given equation to check. So that's going to be negative 48 or 8 minus 6 equals to negative 12. Uh, that's going to be negative 6 minus 6 equals to negative 12. And we have negative 12 on the left hand side and negative 12 on the right hand side. Hence, the equation is proved.